Do you know that European Union have made it mandatory to indicate the customers of the product price changes? So what exactly is European Union Price Indication Directive and why it is required? According to the directive dated 27th November 2019 of the European Parliament and Council, if you are selling products to your customers within the European Economical Area, then you need to display the lowest price offered for a product in the last 30 days. This will help offer transparency to your customers and will save them from fake price inflation or discounts. Complying with the European Union Price Indication Directive can be a tedious task for the store merchants as they have to do it manually. Our PrestaShop EU Price Indication Directive module can automate this process for you by showcasing the lowest price offered for a product within the last 30 days or more. Customers can now check the previous price of the product and compare it with the current price. Hi everyone, I am Ashish and today we will be discussing the workflow Presto Shop EU Price Indication Directive. With this extension, the admin can enable the European Union price indication for specific countries, categories and user groups. The admin can set the duration to display the minimum previous price. So let's have a detailed discussion regarding this plugin. But before proceeding further, I would like you to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to receive the latest updates from our end. As you can see, I have successfully logged into the backend of Presta Shop. Click here to configure the module settings. The module configuration is divided into two sections. First one is price indication settings and second is cron settings. Let's discuss the price indication settings first. From here, the admin can enable or disable this particular extension. If enabled, then the lowest prior price will display on the product page. The second option is label name. Here, the admin can set the custom text that will display to the customer. Here, the admin needs to use the variable duration which will be replaced by the number of days on the product page. From here, the admin can set the price template content. The admin can use this variable to show the previous selling price to the customer. In this field, the admin needs to set the maximum number of days for which he wants to display the minimum previous price. Kindly note that this number should not be less than 30. Suppose the admin has set 45 days here. So, the minimum product price offered for a product within the last 45 days will appear on the product page. From here, the admin can choose to display the tax excluded or tax included price on the product page. From here, the admin can choose to apply the price indication on all the products only on discounted products or only on non-discounted products. Enable this field to show price indication on the new products. 
in these two fields the admin needs to select the country and categories for which he wants to show the price indication this option lets admin select the user group whose members can view the price indication on the product page suppose the admin has selected the user group customer so now the user belonging to this group can view the price indication on the product page here the admin can select the product for which he do not want to show the price indication type the initial letters of the product name here and select the product from the drop down list after configuring the module settings let's have a look at the front end as said by admin from the back office the minimum price of a product charged previously in within the set duration will display on the product page this is the price content and label as said by admin from the back office the admin can view the price change history date wise under the pricing tab in the edit product page if the admin has changed the price of a product multiple times in a day then the lowest price of a product will display on the product page now let's discuss the cron settings In default pressure shop the product price is managed according to the user group country and currency depending on the discount to save the price change history the admin needs to add this link in the server cron, cron tab manager when the cron is set on hourly basis the price history will be saved automatically So this was all about our Pressure Shop EU Price Indication Directive module. I hope you like this video. Thank you for watching this video and have a great day ahead.